This cute little thing is a tardigrade, one of the smallest animals on the planet. Tardigrades live in all kinds of habitats, from high mountains to deep oceans. But you can also find them in ponds, in soil and especially in moss, which is why they are also known as moss piglets. Most tardigrades are roughly 0.02 inches long. But the smallest ones can be 10 times smaller than that. And the biggest ones only grow to around 0.07 inches. Even though these animals can have several thousand cells, they are so small that some single-celled organisms like stentors are far larger. These animals look a bit like microscopic gummy bears. But these have eight legs, which all end in several claws. Some species like this one are herbivores and waddle around in the microworld grazing on algae like microscopic cows. But other species like this one are hunters and eat things like bacteria and even other tardigrades. Tardigrades are egg layers and many species lay their eggs inside of their own shed skin called the cuticle. This protects the eggs from predators until they are ready to hatch and the tardigrade babies are ready to crawl out into the real world. When water is scarce, tardigrades can enter an inactive hibernation-like state called cryptobiosis. In this state, tardigrades are known for their incredible, almost supernatural abilities to survive extreme conditions. The animals can survive temperatures close to absolute zero and way past boiling radiation a thousand times greater than humans can survive and pressure six times higher than the deepest parts of the ocean. In the active state, tardigrades live for around two years, but in their desiccated inactive state, they can survive for decades, maybe even centuries. Tardigrades are so tough in their inactive state that they were sent into space in 2007 to see if they could survive the vacuum of space and cosmic radiation. When they were brought back 10 days later, they were woken from their protective state with a drop of water and continued with their life like nothing had happened. However, tardigrades have been to space more than once. Last year, several thousand were on a spacecraft headed for the moon. Unfortunately, something went wrong and the spacecraft crashed into the moon. But with the tardigrades' abilities to survive both pressure, temperature, vacuum and radiation, some speculate that these tiny astronauts could still be alive on the surface of the moon just waiting to be woken from their cryptobiosis with a bit of water. <laughs>